Before watching this video, don't forget to click on the subscribe button. Soda glycerin ear drops is a prescription medicine. It is used to remove softened, dry or hardened ear wax. Ear wax is naturally produced by your body to protect the skin inside your canal. Sometimes the ear wax become hard and dry resulting in the hearing problem. In that case, soda glycerin ear drops may helpful for you. It is also used to ease pain, swelling, and pressure linked with some ear infections. The soda glycerin ear drops may help effectively in reducing the ear infection. How to use soda glycerin ear drops? First of all, wash your hands properly. Now, adjust the ear drops to room temperature for about half an hour. Now, tilt your head slightly and gently pull the ear rope to straighten the ear canal. Now, release 3 or 4 ear drops. Keep your ear facing upwards for around 5 to 10 minutes. Use almost 3 or 4 drops twice daily for almost 3 to 5 days. Whenever you use the soda glycerin air drops, allow the solution to remain in your air for about 5 to 10 minutes. If your symptoms are not getting improved within 5 days, so make sure consult to your doctor for better treatment procedures. Side effects the soda glycerin ear drops can cause the irritation and itching. While sometimes it may cause dryness in your ear canal. When not to use, it is contraindicated in patients with known hypersensitivity to the drug. Consider your doctor advice if you have a burst or perforated ear drum. Or recently, if you had an ear surgery, if you have a hole in your ear drum, also ask your doctor if you have discharge come out of the ear. Do not use the ear drops if the bottle has been open for longer than four weeks. Prevention Do not try to clean your ear with the help of cotton buds or any other objects because it can compact the wax and make condition worse. You can only wipe outside of your ear with a piece of clean cloth. After a while, flakes or crust of ear wax often fall out bit by bit. Even you may not notice the wax as it comes out of your ear. Uh, 